right. We are done. Right, I have shared it to everyone. I can now unmute. Well, I'm not going to unmute you yet because I need to do my intro of it and I don't want you all ruining it. <laughs> not. I. You. It's okay. Hello, everyone. I've asked. Uh, they can't hear you guys. They can hear me. But yes. Anyway, hello, everyone. Welcome back to the stream. Uh, yes, you can see the cam lovely camera bit that's blocking. Uh, we are live. We are streaming against the UK boys. Uh, we are going to be playing some live Commander today. Uh, very excited. Looking forward to it. Uh, mainly because I haven't played Paid and Magic in probably about ooh, a month and a bit now. And uh, the UK boys, well, they've been in constant in and out of lockdown. So God knows when they last played as well. But uh, we're all excited just to get stuck in and uh, play some games. And uh, without further ado, I'm going to unmute them and they can start talking themselves. And we're also going to go live to Spell Table. We are using Spell Table today. Cannot wait. Looking forward to it. It's I love playing on Spell Table because it is sweet. Um, so, hello, boys. You are live. They can hear you. Hello. Uh, there's, hello. No, there's no point in doing the uh, the uh, usual... Uh, do, this is live. Do not swear because I don't give a damn. Um, <laughs> so, for me, it is a... <laughs> For, for me, it is obviously very early UK, uh, very early in the morning, well, not very early in the morning, but uh, it is a beautiful sunny day with zero clouds in the sky, um, probably looking at a decent 20 degrees today, I'm not, uh, so it means it's a perfect day for me to play magic, because why do I want sunshine and lovely weather anyway? Uh, the boys are obviously all, you all know them from previous uh, videos and streams on the, um, on our channel, which is, uh, these are the Oxhead boys. Um, we've got Steve with us, Chris and Adam, and we've gone to play some Sweet Commander. Chris, can I just say I love that player map, man. <laughs> it's my favourite. That is, that is my favourite player. That is an awesome player map. As soon as I saw it in um, when I got it, I like must have. Yeah, I know. I just I figured I'd bring I figured I'd bring the nostalgia for today's game, you know, because this is like <laughs> the uh, the the main player map I always play. <laughs> For commander because you know yeah. it is it is the the best one let's be honest so um what we're gonna do is we'll go around the table oh hello david spence have a good david spence have a good game and do not let adam win i tell you what david just for you <laughs> we're gonna make sure we don't let adam win today <laughs> adam. so what we're gonna do we're gonna go around the table we're gonna uh to explain our commanders i'll kick it off uh, i am playing uh omnath locus of rage uh because He's the first foil mythic I ever pulled. This is this is uh, now showing my age. I feel like it's showing my age now, uh, <laughs> and how much of a MTG baby I am. Uh, but uh, obviously, what I'm doing is creating a lot of elementals, and then hopefully, uh, hopefully, uh, getting rid of them so then I can. Hang on, hang on. Are we back live? We can do it. We can do it. Yes, we can. <laughs> oh, all perfect timing. Um, Hello, gents. Uh, <laughs> Welcome <laughs> back. This is this is I'm... how everyone can tell we are playing live. This is not a record <laughs> because Jesus, you know. I mean, come on, man. Oh. We got to do a chat. How far? Have we got to do, do our intros again? I, I I literally I got to Adam literally holding his card and that was it. <laughs> so he didn't, even, I didn't he didn't even get a word out. <laughs> so, yeah. I was just saw what Adam was playing, he just quit. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Right. Adam scooped. There we go. Right. Should we still that again? Okay. Hello, Adam, would you like to explain your commander today, please? So I've got CSA Weatherlight Captain. It's a two two and it gets one plus one plus one for each other colour of uh, legendary permanence I control. And then I can pay uh one colour one manner of each colour, and I can start to search for uh, other legendaries within my deck and put them onto the battlefield. So hopefully I should be flooding the uh, battlefield with Planeswalkers. Oh, uh -huh. yay. So, yeah, he took away a Traxa <laughs> and put in bloody Sissy. Fabulous. Right, okay. Yep. <sighs> right, Stephen, do you want to go next? Uh, yeah. Um, so I'm running Calamax of Storm Sires from the Commander decks last year. Um, so... It copies, when it's tapped, it copies the first it's a spell you cast. So this is all about copying spells, this deck. Um, so hopefully I can get an infinite copy combo going or just get a really big Calamax and just 
go in. You've got infinite turns corner. in this, haven't you? You've, um, got, you've got you've got extra turn spells, haven't you? I already know it. Uh, by the time he finishes his turns, it feels yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right, okay. I'll see how it's going to go. It's not fully go. upgraded yet. I haven't upgraded it as much as I oh, want don't to. You, but... Steven, don't you give me that. I already know you. Right. It's like a good 20 minutes <laughs> upgrade off one. Uh... All right. Chris, your final, final one. Okay, so my commander is Kaikal Winds Fury, which he's a flying. And whenever you cast a non-creature spell, you get to create a 1-1 one, one white spirit token with flying. And then I can sacrifice it for red mana. So as you can imagine, I'm going to be casting lots of non-creature spells and creating a lot of tokens to actually hit people with. So it gets real fun very quick. All right. Awesome. So without further ado, we're going to get to starting the game. So what I'll do is i will got to randomize the order. Whoever is in the top left will be first player. So good luck, gents. Let's have some fun. Good um, luck. Randomized, oh. randomized play order. Do do do. It's me. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's me. Oh, for, okay. but, <laughs> it's me. Uh, the, only, the, it, the only people who swapped were Steve and Chris. That's fine. You know, that's all right. I don't mind that. <laughs> <laughs> right. I've got my seven cards ready. Is everyone else? Uh, I am dealing now. All right. Ugh. You used to you used to use guys get so tell me when you're ready to start and we will kick off this game. And have some fun. I am going to keep my hand. Hey. I'm going to try this keep. Yeah, I'm going to keep this as well. All right. Okay. So, without further ado, let's. Oh, we get a space bar, and let's start. Right. Uh, going to kick off with a windswept teeth. Um, I'm going to sack it and cr crack it, and go get um some form of land. Probably something with a forest in, you know, just to make my life a little bit easier. Because, um, you know, that's just better. Um, where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? I know which one I'm trying to think of. I can't <coughs> think of the bleeding name now. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Well, forest. No, I want a specific jewel and I can't remember the name of it. Oh, oh. I've got, you've got to remember, right? I had I had a late night last night, all right, before starting, all right? So I am tired. Leave me alone. <laughs> Do you say party? What's a party? Uh, I decided to yeah. drink some very strong, heavy, uh, very strong 7% beer last night. Uh, stomping ground. That's the word one I was thinking of. Oh, okay. And guess what? It was the next card I was going to draw. So that was brilliant. <laughs> God <laughs> six. Right. Um, without further ado, I'll then pass the turn to you, Adam. Cool. Nope. So I'm going to draw. Uh, Why is it not working? My yeah. turn is quite simple. I am going to play a forest. I'm going to tap one and play a Lanawar Elf. And then I'll pass the go. Okay. Someone bolt it. <laughs> oh, oh, I've also got to lose a life as well. There we go. Right, I'll draw. Jordan's weak, uh, kill him. I'm going to play one spot over three. Uh, first, first blood to myself. I'll tell you what, actually, because we haven't played to, we because we haven't played together in what, nearly two and a half years now? Uh, it's going to be, yeah. it, you guys are going to probably be very interested to see when, because I've added a lot of new cards to this deck. This this deck is no longer the same kind of deck that we played against from last time. <laughs> so it's going to be mm. interesting to see what you guys think if I get around to any of my new, newer cards. Right, I'm going to get out a Botanical Sanctum. Um, I will play it and play a Soaring. And pass. All right. Uh, the uh, <laughs> okay, draw for turn. I am going to play an exotic orchard because I'm that exotic, and I'm going to pass the turn. Okay. Nice. Uh, draw. Uh, untap. Draw. Uh, play homeward path. So home. For any of you who aren't aware, homeward path. Uh, you can tap it for coolest man, or you can tap it in each player gains control of all creatures he or she owns. A very good utility card for commander. And I'm going to pay two and play Bright Half Banneret. So it's a 1-1, one, one, and elemental and warrior spells cost one less, and I can reinforce, which is discard a card and put a 1-1 one, one count on a target creature, but I want it on the board. 
And then okay. I will pass the turn to you guys. Uh, I'll untap. Draw. Uh, uh, I'll play Command Town. I'm going to attack for white, green, and green. And play my commander, CC. Okay. So it's, um, and what, a 2-2 two, two at the moment? 2-2, two, two, yes. Two, two. Yeah. At the moment. Yeah. Uh, and I'll pass a go. Oh. Okay, I'll untap. Draw. Uh, <laughs> oh, so what did everyone think? Uh, what's everyone thinking of the Cal Time sp uh, spoilers so far? As a question. Well, I've, I've got to be honest, I'm so out of touch with magic at the moment. Uh, <laughs> I, I have I'm, to say, I'm, I'm, I'm rather impressed with some of the uh, um, some of the creature archetypes. Some dwarfs are getting some love, which is going to be interesting. And uh, yeah, mm. I'm looking forward to playing some uh, angry, angry dwarfs and dragons myself. <laughs> yeah, there's a nice dragon I saw that might slot into my other commander deck. Mm -hmm. So, Commander Sphere. Uh, Steve. I'm from Fear and then pass. Okay. Four in turn. Uh, Steve that. Been I'm sorry. Um, brainstorm. Okay. okay. Forbidden Orchard is it's Steve. only any mana that you can that we can produce, isn't it? If I remember right. Yeah. Right, okay. Yes. Just went to Steve's got a bad what are you asking, Adam? It's any colours because I've got command tower anyway. Although apparently um, although apparently yes. Chris, when I've just clicked on Forbidden Orchard, apparently it's actually Gerard's wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> Each ca um, for each card in your hand, you gain two land. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> okay, draw for ten. Um, this is I'm where you find to... hidden gems by just clicking random cards, getting another card. <laughs> there we go. I'm we got play it. Play got a... it no, I'm going to play a plane, and I'm going to pass the turn. Okay. All right. All right. Draw for turn. Ooh. Ooh. Um, no, don't want to do that. Um, right. I'm going to play a mountain, tap for three, and play um, Command Sphere. Because, yep. you know, it, it seems like, you know, it's a nice piece of mana ramp. Because, and, <laughs> yep. and then um, I'm going to move to combat. And because, yep. because yep. it has been so long, and because I'm so bitter still, I'm going to attack Steve for one. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, boys. <laughs> and then, and then uh, I would go and pass the dead to Adam. Sure. Answer. Draw. I'm going to take two and play an overgrown two. Okay. There we go. Uh, I'm going to tap for Command Tower tapping for red. Mm -hmm. I am going to play Arlen Cord. Okay. So Arlen Cord is plus one until the end of the turn. Target creature gets plus two, plus two, and gains vigilance haste. Or its zero is uh, creates a two two green wolf, which transforms and does other things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, but I'm not gonna, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to plus one for now, so I'm going to turn, uh, give Cissé plus two, plus two, so it's currently a six, six with Vigilance and Haste. Nice. And mm. I'm going to go to combat. D3, and probably D3, D3. He's going, uh, because uh, <laughs> he's probably going to hit me at some point and counting my shit, I'm going to go for Steve. Uh, <laughs> so <Steve>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Oh, that's good. If we were in, if you were in the same boat, you would have done it to me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll pass again. <laughs> oh, thanks. See, I do do something nice to you. Uh... <laughs> uh, I'll play an exotic orchard. Uh... Hmm. God, everyone's got exotic orchards. <laughs> it's turning into quite an exotic <laughs> game. Neither do I. <laughs> I was finally caught in order, so I couldn't forget what mana it tapped for. 
Well, it's just one of those things. Yeah, it's it is useful because you just you get it's essentially you're getting if you uh, it's really more it's the, the blah, 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 blah. it's best when you've got anything that you're going to steal spells or you can copy spells and get or copy abilities or do something yeah. like that. You know, if like if you've got um oh, what is it <clears throat> mirage mirror and you can obviously copy a permanence and then you can copy a permanence got an activated ability with a color in then you can use it and blah blah blah. So it's rather good. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to play my commander and pass. Okay. Kill it. Um, Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it now. Kill it. In response. In response. Oh. Yeah. <gasps> oh. I'm going to disdain, disdainful smut stroke it. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Well. We're all waiting on Steve. Well. <laughs> That's nice. I feel like I might. Uh... <laughs> Sorry, uh, did I mention this was Arch Envy oh, Commander? Sorry about that. <laughs> uh, I'll stop, Steve. <laughs> right, my turn. Uh, yeah, it's your turn, bud. Cool. <laughs> Edwin, Edwin, um, Edwin Colasso says, says, "Poor Steve. Is... <laughs> Poor Steve. Laugh out loud. Rest in peace." <laughs> I'm gonna play a man. <laughs> And then mountain, and I'll pass a go after that. Yeah, Edwin, Edwin, just just to give some context, <laughs> there is a long history of grudges against Steve for many, <laughs> many a commander game. So you know, it's it's hard to let that stuff go. Let's be honest. Right, we're gonna untap. I'm gonna draw. Uh... Adam's no better at the best of times. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! That might have changed things. Oh, that might have changed things a little bit. <laughs> right. I'm going to play Primal Beyond. So when it enters, uh, when it comes into play, I reveal an elemental card from my hand. If I don't, it enters tapped. I will reveal Cavalier of Flame. Oh god! Yeah. <laughs> don't. Oh god! There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with it. It's fine. It's fine. Um, and then I'm going to uh, tip for four mana because of Bright Half Banneret, costing one less. I'm going to play Cavalier of the Flame. Uh, when it enters the battlefield, I get to discard any number of cards and I get to draw that many cards. I'm planning on discarding. Um, I'm going to discard two cards, which is Regal Force and Anger. Now, as long as Anger's in the graveyard, all my creatures have haste. Yeah. All right. It's all right. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. Right. And then I get to draw two cards. Thank you. And then... Ooh, that's going to be nice. Right. And then I'm going to move to combat. And we're going to spread some love around this time. So, sorry, Chris. This is coming at you. I will attack for seven. Right. For that, <laughs> I'm going to store the power unless you're um, Cavalier of Flame. Swords of Plashes, yep. So I get... Uh, I was Swords again. I get life? No. What do I do? Yeah, you get X target creature. It's controller gains life equal to its power. Power. So six life. Sweet. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'll take, and I'll take one. Right. So then you take one, and then, yeah. and then I'll pass the turn to you, Adam. Six exile. Do you not get it back? Oh, yes. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> all right. It's in exile. It's in exile. Uh, I am going to play a fable passage. I'm going to sack the fable passage. Mm -hmm. uh, I am going to search for an island, and it comes in untapped. Well, it comes in tapped, then comes untapped. Uh, <laughs> Oh, and for the comments from the chat, uh, Edwin does say, um, sadly, Steve, you are the Calmax player, so he's really not sorry, though. <laughs> <laughs> Calmax, man. Calmax not getting love around this table, man. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Is it bad if I hit Steve again? Yes. <laughs> pick on your brother. Look at, look um, at that. Oh, um, oh, tapped out, Jordan. No, do not pick on your brother. <laughs> pick on your brother. You're yeah. not tapped out, Steve. You've got a soul ring untapped. <laughs> yes, you've got to watch out for that two mana, two mana destroy the board effect <laughs> at instant speed. Yeah, two colorless mana. <laughs> two colorless mana. Yeah. Right. 
Two colors mana, destroy the board at okay. instant speed. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Before I start swinging at people, I suppose, mm -hmm. uh, I should really do some stuff. Uh, you should, yes. So I am going to tap four. I am going to play Teferi, Master of Time. Oh, oh God. God. Oh. <laughs> Teferi! Oh, Adam. Adam, Adam, Adam. <laughs> Teferi! I play Calamax, uh, but he plays Teferi. Okay. <laughs> Why? That'll be next turn. I play, I play two to pay. Uh, right, Steve, Steve, I think you're now uh, off the hook, bud. Don't worry. I'm going to plus one. I'm going to give Cissé plus two, plus two, vigilance and haste. Uh, I am. It is now a three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, I'm going to go to combat. Jordan, you've got the most health, so I'm going to swing seven at you. Okay. Down to 38. Uh, you, you made that sound like you were very disappointed. Oh no, I've got. Oh no, it's all right. I, I've got plans. I've got plans. Uh, I'm gonna plus one to fairy and draw and discard. Yep. That's good cards here. That's a problem. Uh, I think I can do that. I will discard a. Blood Crypt. And I will pass the turn. Okay. It's on you, Steve. One tap. Draw. I don't know why they thought they'd make a Planeswalker that, you know, you could activate in your opponent's turn. They thought that was a good idea. <laughs> they obviously weren't thinking about Commander. So no, of course they don't. Oh yeah, because yeah, because we all know the wizards always thinks about commander when they're printing cards. It's just like when they think about downgrading cards to 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 uh, common. They don't, you know, they always think about pauper and the ramifications that will happen. Oh, so far behind now. Um... Well, it's all right. I think Adam's put himself on the throne quite nicely now. So yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm in, I've only got an Ireland. Signet. Signet, nice. I've got six minutes. I think I might. Do I just want to play my commander again? Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. Stay. So stay. You, I, I, two I, men are on tap. I, I'm. I, I'm happy to leave your commander alone. Because um, I need to, we need to start dealing with. Uh... I have one green mana. <laughs> I want to put creatures on the board to put pressure on his planeswalkers. Uh, yeah, yeah. Steve, I'm, I'm, I've got no reason to counter it. I'm kind of going to be honest here. Yeah. I think, I think, I'll boys, we can all agree that, that, that there is a certain board state that needs to be put in check, right? <laughs> what is he anyway? Is he a four four? Yeah, yeah four four. It's, it's four four. Yeah. Okay. Whenever I copy an instant spell, it gets a counter on it. Yeah. It's five points, CC, yeah? Uh, oh, it's only four. CC's a... Five, five. Blue, green, red. Oh, yeah. And starts okay. as two. Yeah. It might not matter anyway, but... Yeah. My turn. <sighs> okay. Oh, uh, end of Steve's go, sorry. I'm just going to pass one to her. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And so... Nearly forgot. Right. Untap. Mountain. I'm going to play Storm's Wrath. Right. What was that? Uh, four oh. damage to each creature in each planeswalker. Well, that's back in the. Uh... Oh, <laughs> Christ's sake. It doesn't kill Adam's planeswalkers, does it? No. No, no down to one each. Mm. It's a good bit of damage, though. Yeah, once right. the board's so that. Nobody can attack Hi. Adam's brains because. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Well done. well done, Chris. Well done, Chris. <laughs> Helpful, Chris. Anyway, right. Well, at least I'm doing something here. <laughs> Chris, are you passing the turn? Yeah, I passed. Uh, yeah. I'm going to plus one to Fairy at the end. Just presume I'm plus one into Fairy at the end of each turn. No, uh, you've got to say. You've got to say it. You've got to say it. I've got to say it. I've got to say it. If you, if you forget, it's your own fault. Uh, <laughs> Right. Uh, yeah, carry on. All right. Okay. So, drop. Okay. I play. Uh, 
Valakut of the Molten Pinnacle. Let's see. Uh, I might have to do it that way. Do it that way? Yeah, do it that way. Right, okay, we go with... Um, um, <coughs> for three mana, play Growing Rites of Ithlamog. Uh, when I enter the battlefield, I get to look at the top four cards and s reveal a creature. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Oh. I want that. I want that. But I can't have that. That's not fair. Um. Two, four. Yeah, oh, I've got so many good choices. There's so many options in this hand. I've got to play the smart way, though. And I'm going to reveal Ancient Green Warden. That goes to my hand. Oh. Was that it? Ancient Green Warden um, I, allows me to uh, play land cards from my graveyard. And if a land enters the battlefield, causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control, it triggers an additional time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Two Valakut. So uh, two Valakut triggers, two Omanath triggers, uh, a couple of other thing triggers, which we won't discuss. Anyway, <laughs> but yeah, so that's not the battle. Is no, no, it's in my hand. No, in no. my hand. Oh, uh... <laughs> um, yeah. So, although there was another card that I really wanted. Really wanted, but I'd, I'd have to draw a land to play it. So, yeah, so that's the reason why I took this. <laughs> right. Um, I'm then going to have to pass the turn. End step. Yep. Draw and discard. Yep. Sure. Uh, Braska goes to the bin. Uh, untap. Draw. Stomping ground. Uh, I am going to take two. If I counter this draw it, red, black, blue, green, white, yeah. <coughs> Palace of the Ring. It's the colours of the river. Oh dear. Sorry, just doing maths. Oh no. Oh no, that's no, no, that's, no, no, that, that's not that's not a good sign. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Whenever you whenever you say <laughs> that, <laughs> whenever you say that, Adam, it generally means that we're all gonna lose about half our life total. Because <laughs> that's normally what you do. Sorry, I'm just going to do the math. Right. No, it's just I'm trying to decide how greedy I'm going to be. Uh... Oh, okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to the greedy option because it's fun. I'm going to give this plus two, plus two haste and vigilance. So what is it? Uh, it's currently a three, four, five, six, uh, sorry, four, five, six, seven, seven, seven. It's a seven. I'm going to tap five. I'm can search for any legendary in my deck that is six or less. Mm-hmm. And then it goes to ha no, it goes no, it goes to the goes on the battlefield. Goes on the battlefield. <laughs> oh. Right. Yeah. Uh... Problem is, when I start these, I never really think through the whole turn, and I just go, "Oh, let's just go and get this instead." Uh... We should make him name it, shouldn't we? That's what we should do. <laughs> Force him to do. He has to name it before he searches. <laughs> That'll teach him, so he can't get any ideas. <laughs> uh, that could be fun. That's horrible. Okay. I can't get Oko out. That's just me. Uh... <laughs> oh, oh, Adam! If you want, if you want to cruise him for a bruising pal, you will be going that way. <laughs> you want to play your commander with a free free elk? Uh... <laughs> That's el it? elk for you, and an elk for you. <laughs> uh, I can't find it now. What the f oh, yeah, let's go for this. 
I am going to play Over to Fairy. Oh. So. Wait. No. <laughs> oh, Adam. 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 Oh. Adam, this will not stand, Adam. I'm sorry. <laughs> when Oaf of Teferi enters the battlefield, I may exile another target permanent I control and return it at the beginning of the next end step. I will bounce the command tower. All planeswalkers I control get an extra ability each turn. Uh, so I'm going to plus two Arling, uh, one Arling Court and make Cissé a nine, oh no, a ten ten. Uh, with Vigilance and Haste. Uh, that's in exile at the moment. Uh, that's plus one. Uh, I am going to go to combat. Oh, well, this just seems meaner on anyone. <laughs> I just, you know what, Jordan, I, I've missed you so much. Ten at you. Uh... <laughs> okay. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I'm probably doing it now. Uh, I'm going to plus one to fairy, draw and discard. Plus one to fairy, draw and discard. Uh, do I want that? Not really anymore. Uh, then I'll pass the go. So at the end step, uh, command tower comes back in. Okay. <sighs> hey, thankful I didn't go for the command damage on you, Steve. <laughs> oh, that's a good point. I've not been tracking commander damage. So I'm at 16. I think I'm uh, uh, yep, hang on. Yes. Because you hit me for Steve, six. Hit no, no. No, you hit me for five the first time. Was it five? Oh, okay. How many did you hit me first? Six. six. Is it six? Uh, eight, how much did you hit me for? I can't remember. Hey, hit me. I'm going to say six for me. Right, so I'm at, yeah. So. No, no, no. No, no, it's perfect. Plus two, plus two. It would be six for me as well. Mm. Uh, you make me feel bad throwing people at Cece because I'll kill them next to <laughs> Well, you should have to spread the love around then, won't you? Uh, well, I'm mm. tapping for and playing Rush Me. Well, that's rude. Oh, yes, says Adam. <laughs> yeah, that's rude. That's rude, <laughs> causing 16 commander damage on turn, turn four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Five. Uh, pass. Uh, end your turn. I'm going to plus one to fairy. I'm going to draw and discard. Um, uh, hang on. Does all for fairy trigger on other people's turns or only on yours? No, on other people's turn as well. So you can. Oh, crike. Right, okay. Yeah. Uh, I for to. Uh, I'll activate the fairy again. Yeah. Continue. Chris. Star of Extinction for somehow for ridiculously cheap, yeah. I wish. <laughs> Twenty damage, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah <Nine. laughs> That's a big sigh, whoever that was. I think it was Chris. <laughs> I'm currently losing the will to live with this. It's alright, that's the reason why we're going to play multiple games today. Because why not? <laughs> Might as well. <laughs> we just ban Adam from playing his deck next day. <laughs> <laughs> the horrible thing is, this wasn't a... Uh, I didn't take this off a list or anything, I've literally just... You just literally put, yeah, it. yeah, but you were playing a Traxxer well, before this, so it's not. It was a good deck, and then Cissé got printed. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Then, uh, <laughs> was it Modern Drivers? Yeah. The th yeah, the thing was, I didn't, I had it in my original 100, and not as my commander until I played it against like Graham and just tooted for three mana to fairy against the counter deck. I was just like, oh, actually, this is pretty good. Oh, uh, it's horrible. It's ridiculous, quite frankly. 
David Spence, you guys had one job. <laughs> <laughs> right, for a start off, Dave. No more words than no. It, it's not my fault. <laughs> I can't help it if Chris kills my commander in two successive yes, turns. Yes, correct. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, if it's anyone's fault, it's Chris's fault. <laughs> Chris, he's that, by the way. He is, he is. He's thinking. He's, oh, okay. He's he's actually thinking he's about time. he's thinking he's thinking about uh, going to uh, your room with uh, probably with a cricket bat and just fixing this issue. <laughs> <laughs> I know I would. I'd be tempted. <laughs> has Chris untapped on the screen? No. No, he hasn't. Chris. Oh, okay. He's thinking whether to untap or not, or whether to leave him tapped. Hello. Who's on the Hello. phone? Hello. Was it my turn now? Yes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> we thought you were thinking. We really thought you were thinking. Was... It's been your <laughs> time for about five minutes. <laughs> Remember when you went and made that big sigh? Yeah. <laughs> that was the start of your turn. <laughs> oh, I didn't realise. <laughs> that's what we thought. That's what I thought you knew, because that was right at the right time. Yeah. Oh. Motion scroll. Oh, what's that do? Search for a... Uh... Blue instant. Reel that card and put it into your hand. Oh, I must admit, I don't know exactly know what's going to help me. At you, this point. You, you're desperate to get Cyclone Rift that you're going to do it for two mana. I wish I had Cyclone Rift. <laughs> Cyclone Rift. <laughs> mm. It can only get better. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do it. I had to do it. He said it. My brain went, do it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Steve has mana. That's what worries me now. How many cards are in hand, Steve? Four. Okay. The blue instant isn't, yeah. I don't know what I want to get. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to do this for the right. Arcane Denial. Okay, uh, what does that do? Is that creature? Was that... Um, counter target spell. That spell's caster may draw up to two cards at the beginning of their next turn's upkeep. Draw a... And then I draw a card at the beginning of the next turn upkeep. Okay. Is that two mana? Uh, yeah. yeah. Do you have a blue weapon? He does now. Off turn. <laughs> 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 ah, damn it! I'm tough. Uh, oh no, at the end of Christmas. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, no, no uh, we fast, we fast, no. we fast. <laughs> uh, I will get rid of gamble, and I will get rid of Astoria command. <clears throat> okay. Right, it's me, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Draw. Oh, I want to do that. But I can't do that. We could do that. We could do that, Jordan. What is Teferi on? Nine. Nine. Which Nine means that yeah, and I've got no way to stop him ultimating. No, I haven't either. Two, four, six. Unless Steve's got bamps. Because he could bounce on the activation of the first one, couldn't he? Play... Oh no, he can't. Oh, so... No, no, yeah. When, yeah, when, whenever you go to activate, yeah. you've automatically done it. So, yeah, he has to do it before that. Uh, play a mountain. There's no Valka trigger yet. I need two more, two more mountains before I can do it. Um, seven mana. Play Omnath. And then I'm gonna have to move to the end step. End step. Yeah. I am going to pass one to Ferry. Any response? No. no. Yes, I'd like to f- lodge a formal complaint to Wizards, of course. I'm going to draw. David Spence. Hang on, David Spence. You're all playing the wrong game. It should be. Uh, it should have been Arch Enemy. I think the next game might be Arch Enemy, regardless of... Uh, I'm going to minus 10 to Ferry. So after Jordan's turn, I get to take two extra turns. Uh... 
You do realize I'm, I'm playing a different game while this is happening now. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right, let's, let's get Magic Arena up. Right. <laughs> All right, if everyone would like yep. to sit uh, back and just listen to some relaxing music. <laughs> I'll try and do this quickly. I'll try and kill you oh. quickly. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, I don't actually have the means to kill you. That's the only problem. Uh, got three turns. Don't worry. Yeah, that's true. I've got three turns and three tutors. Uh, so, let's plus one. Uh, plus one. So this is now a four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm going to tutor. <laughs> David Spence says, okay, please, please let Adam punt fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> if he does, I will laugh so hard. No, you won't be the only one. Uh, I will play Teferi. Six mana Teferi. He's come back. Uh... So, Temporal Archmage, look at the top card, plus one, look at the top card of your library, put one of them into your hand, no, two cards, and look at them, put one in your hand, and the other one bottom. Untap, four target permanents, you get an emblem with you, may activate abilities, planes, walkers at instant speed. Yep, okay. Uh, I'm gonna minus one, untap four. Uh, I'm gonna I'm do something now. Oh, oh um, sorry. Yeah. No, 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 with the, yeah, with the minus one on the stack. Okay. Yeah. Um, this isn't going to work really, but this is the only real time I've got to try it. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. Uh, I'm going to cryptic command and bounce the fairy back to your hand. Um, okay. And. Right. And draw a card, I suppose. <laughs> um, I have one colorless mana floating, but uh, rush me trigger first. Ooh, oh, yeah. sorry. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, it's a command tap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, very goes to your hand, and I draw a card. Okay. That's made it really awkward because I know Chris. Yeah, I know it's going to make it awkward, uh, but I think you'll do it. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> so, he's bounced, he's cryptic command and bounced the Teferi Temporal Archmage back to hand. Yeah. So, yeah. So right now, and Adam knows that, that. And Adam knows you've got that character kind of spell. <laughs> um, I can't do any. I, I can't do anything. What do you mean you can't do anything? You're not got blue mana. No, I never. I never said I had one open. I can't see the light shining on your screen. Are so you I kidding, Chris? <laughs> Are you kidding oh. me, Chris? I, I've lit, I literally just bluffed my way through. Are you kidding me, Chris? <laughs> <laughs> I've been man star this whole game. I am gonna uh, physically hurt you, Chris, when I see you next. Why? <laughs> I was right, let's try and kill. God. Oh. Let's try and kill people off. Uh... <laughs> I can't do. I, I literally can't do anything. So if, Ad, can you actually kill us? Or... Hang on, we wait. I'm let's... trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. I unfortunately I haven't got six mana, so I need to rely on drawing mana next turn because I've yeah, that's what I'm... Uh... <laughs> well, I don't think uh... you don't have your land really. That's why I hope. I'm gonna tap for. I'm going to cast Spark Double, copy an Arlen Cord. Okay. Comes in with an extra counter. Uh, I'm gonna plus one. Oh, do I plus one? It's not got trample. Uh. Copies don't Cop transform, do they? No. Uh, no. They, no, no, they no, 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 no. The transform. Do they ex They go to the exile, don't they? So, yeah. If he, if you transform it, it won't come back. If I remember okay. right, I think. Um, if it does get exiled, um, otherwise you flip it over to a planeswalker with lots of counters that have no abilities. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I might as well give this plus two, plus two, trample and haste, plus two, plus two, trample and haste. It's now, so it's got eight buff from Arling Cord, uh, plus four buff from Legendaries, so it's plus 12, so it's a 14, 14. Uh, 
I'm going to force one of you two to block with your creatures. Jordan, I'm going to go 14 at you. Oh, I have to put our mouth in the in front. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, so uh, I will end my current turn and move on to extra turn number two. Yeah. So two turns left. Uh, draw. Didn't get the land. Uh, I am going to... Oh, no, do this first. Uh, buff Cissé up to a... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. An eight, eight. Uh, tap five. Go and choose for something fun. Yeah. I'll get an Oath of Ajani. Uh, so when Oath of Ajani enters the battlefield, mm -hmm. I get a put plus one plus one counter on each creature I control. The Cisa gets one. Gets one. Uh, then I'm going to put a further plus two on it and another further plus four plus four on this. So plus uh, two, four, six, eight, who do we appreciate? Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I am going to go to combat and fifteen at Steve. Fifteen at me. Yeah. So um Sure. You will die to commander damage, Steve. Oh, yeah, well, why not? Well, block, has he got trampled or not? No, he's not he's got trampled. No. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Uh, then I'll move on to my last go. Yeah. Uh, as planeswalkers are one less now, I'm going to play Teferi. Uh, I'm going to minus four. Yep. Uh, I'm going to untap. Uh, I'm going to tap for blue, green, red, white. This doesn't have floating mana on it, does it? No, it doesn't. No. No. Blue, green, red, white. Remember that. So what am I missing? Black. Uh, yeah. So I'm missing black. Okay. Uh, I will untap a further four. Tap for black tutor. All my remaining mana's gone. I'll actually get that. I will get animatic. I'm not going to shuffle my deck because I'm going to shoot her again. Uh, yeah, this is... Uh... Uh, I'm going to bounce to Fairy. Uh, I've got red and blue. Untap four. White, green, red, blue. Oh, I can't. oh black. Yep. Tap, shooter. Yeah. I am now going to present an infinite combo rather than boring everyone's death. Okay, uh, let's hear it then. So, I am going to get Nico Bonus. The one that copies Planeswalker's abilities. Uh, so, what I can do now, I'll make this very, very short. I've got infinite mana because Bolas can untap for four. This can untap for four. Whenever Animatu is going to run out, I'll use Bolas to bounce Animatu. So I'll get into it amp activations from... Does that make sense? Or do mm. you want me to show it once? Okay. Uh, so using this process, I can gain infinite mana. Right. But not a way mm. to kill you yet. Uh, so then I will tutor. You can just tutor every legendary in your deck. Well, quite simply, what I'll do is tutor for the chamber and then I will tick Bolas up 
uh, everyone exiles a card from their hand or the battlefield. Okay. And then using the infinite mana, I'm going to, well, I can use Chain Veil once, play last again. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to minus one to Fairy. Uh, tap three lands. I'm going to untap Chain Veil. So I'll plus one by last again. And then plus one in again. Yeah, you can just keep untapping Chain Veil. Yeah, so I can keep. Yeah. So then I would need to uh, untap Chain Veil with Fairy. Uh, tap again to activate again. And then once I've done that, I'll use four mana. Uh, and about to get a bounce to fairy. Minus one, untap chain valve, tap four, then I'll ultimate bolas, which is each opponent loses a game if they don't control, control a legendary. So Jordan survives. Uh, Yay! Three <laughs> Sorry. Three <laughs> <Rachel, laughs> Just as planned. <laughs> <laughs> oh fine, I'll swing uh, infinite, infinite say at you, uh, Jordan. Uh, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. All right, that was a good fun. All right. Yeah. Sadly, sadly. Now you see why we. Now you see why we hate this deck. <laughs> yes. No, you can definitely see why. Yeah, I mean, my, my the only plan I had was to obviously next turn if Omnath survived was to ancient Green Warden. Double up the triggers from my um, Windswept Heath entering twice, so I'd end up with quite a few 5-5s. Five and then they've all got haste because of yeah. anger, and then I can swing at Adam and cause lots of problems. But yeah, what would I have drawn? I got mana screwed that game. Yeah. Right, so we'll... I just have my commander removed quite a lot. 